Hey there, in this video, we're going to take a look at the video widget and I'm going to show you some ways in which you can configure it. For us to get started, I am going to bring in a new video widget into the canvas and we can see the video widget showing up. The first property we can configure is the URL property. So here is where we um, supply the URL of the video we want showing up in the video widget. I'm going to paste something in and we can see that video loaded up within the video widget. Moving on, we can also set this video to autoplay by um, turning on the switch. And what that would do is that whenever the page renders, this video would automatically play. And likewise, we can set the visibility of the video widget by toggling on the switch on and off. Or we can go into the JavaScript mode, and this also applies for the autoplay property. We can go into the JavaScript mode and write some um, conditional logic to dynamically set that property on or off. And we have some actions that we can configure. We can go ahead to run an action whenever the video is played, whenever it is paused, and when the video is completed playing. That is the on end action. And for any of these actions, we can go to execute any of these predefined action, or we can go into the JavaScript mode and write some conditional logic we want to be executed when that action is fired. So this has been the video widget. I hope you found this helpful. 